What's up, man? You ready for your premiere, Pam? Yeah, where are we going? Tell them. We're going to Christian's premiere, where originally they posted that one show was going to open up, one theater. Yeah. Right? Sold out so quick, so they opened two. Sold out so fast, so three. Sold out. Three movie theaters. Yeah. So, I have a lot of friends that were like, I want to go. I was like, sorry. I, I can know. do too. Yeah. yeah. I can get tickets. And the reason, feel, like, the reason we're not putting this uh, documentary on YouTube and the reason it's only going to be premiered here in person is because Justin, myself, Kirby, we have plans on submitting this into like all the film festivals and from almost all of those festivals you can't submit and like win if you publish your video on like platforms on the website like on the internet so um that's why but it will eventually like eventually be available to watch available <laughs> available it'd be available but available uh to watch but and i'll let you know when but this is like the one one night you'll be able to see it ever in history right now so it's called i'm just a youtuber we're dressed all nice red carpet yeah, look at that navy suit White wife beater, rolled up sleeves, gold watch. How he's looking great. Thank you. In black dress <laughs> and black, pants. Pants <laughs> But uh, what's super cool is that this movie theater that we're going to is like where me and my parents would go all the time. My brother, like as a family, growing up, like they opened up probably when I was like in sixth grade or fifth grade mm -hmm. or something, and then any because they serve food while you watch the theater. So it was like, holy crap, it was like so nice for us to go there. And now we're like premiering there. So That's it's like cool. four minutes from my parents' house too, which is wild, but very excited. So we will see you there. We have some secret drink in that little- It's protein shake. It's protein shake. Yeah, I forgot my ring. I'm doing the game. What are you doing in the game, babe? To the people? I am finding myself an Espeon. So I can't find one, so I have to make one. So I have to find a ditto, catch one. Then you uh, take the ditto in an egg to the daycare. I have a whole mission. Uh, I have a whole mission. Babe, on. you're not. I caught the ditto. You're taking Look at an that. egg to the daycare? I haven't found a ditto this whole time, and I just found one. He's right there. Are you so excited? Well, I can't kill him, because if I do, I'm not going to find one for another bit, but i got to weaken him and catch him, so i got some work to do. Okay, we're going to leave you be. I'm gonna show you guys how, like, right now I want to end the game. But usually, like, when you're playing Pokemon, you're mid fight, you can't stop. But here, with this little like game, which I'll link in the description thing, for like 150 bucks, you just you can save. You click that button, save. And then you can just exit. And then you just hold this top button down and shut off. Wait. There. And done. Wow. 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 I want to make some commission on that. Do you have a discount code? On Amazon. I make it. Um, 3%. Is it really 3%? feel low-key I love this outfit like having the sleeves rolled up like this and we can keep filming this I'll show them um, cool. well I actually have it's there's a hair band or a hair tie under here oh. so it's like hair tied onto my wrist and then these are folded over so I don't have to like worry about fixing it Smart. cool right was that sunny yeah and this is like an oversized suit and I've never worn an oversized suit before but I, if I had time, I'd go to the tailor, but we just got the suit in like today. So, um, because it's a boxier silhouette, like it's really important to, one, I'm not gonna button this or close it, because then it's, it's like too boxy. So I'll leave it open. I have a wife beat underneath, which is like lower scoop, so you can show some chest and stuff. And then you have your wrist showing, right? Which is like kind of a really cool, like broad shoulder kind of look. Um, but you wanna like, Anytime you're posing in photos or anything, just be sure you're not 
like arms up, like holding, you know, like in the middle or anything. You need to be on the sides of group photos and kind of like have one hand in the pocket so you kind of like swoop the jacket behind to show the silhouette. Or else it just look like a box. You know what I'm saying? You gotta think of these things, man. You gotta, you gotta, if you look and dress well, you just demand, you demand the room, period. Like, period. 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 Like, just invest in yourself and like pay attention to these little once you learn it's just like anything once you learn how to like play the dress game it's not you don't have to spend tons of money you just need like to learn your silhouette and like what your body what clothes like what style of clothes and like pieces look good on your body shape so you can like and then you can just have fun with it and it's easy and you don't have to think about it mm -hmm. I will say as a woman the suit's nice but it's the top cleavage area that we like. <laughs> Is that what you call it? The top chest? It's all those inclined Collage. barbell benches, you know? I, I like that little... Wait, do that again? It's like the... the, 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 the bow. Bow. <laughs> I like that. It's my favorite. Okay, so low-key, I am like super nervous right now. This feels like 2017, going into like one of the first summer shredding events are pulling up and like not knowing what to expect inside like that is this moment and i am super there's my brother what's up you come here come here you come here it's my brother what's hey, up hey. congratulations hey, thanks. i knew you were coming i ain't seen you since i know it's been a little bit your first show yeah yeah oh well i didn't win the second one a lot's happened since then has it Oh yeah! Engaged. Oh yeah! I got engaged. <laughs> what did you see the ring? Yeah. No, I haven't seen. Babe, babe, babe! Show him the ring. Show, show my brother. Show brother the ring. Oh, yeah, wait, my brother. You're my brother now. You're literally family. I'm, I have to learn. Wait, show him, babe. Show him. Yeah, look, you did so good, right? Wait, let me see. In the sun. Yeah, sparkles. Wow. Isn't that wild? Hi. Hi. Look at the jackets you want to look. Whoa, that's the first show we did here from, this one is from uh, Vegas, and this, the red one is from, damn, this is so sick, so cool, baby. Yeah, stand next to it, right here, in the middle. All right. What's up, Juan? Hey, you want to hold the camera, brother? I was going to say, good time, right? All right. Hey, you too. Yeah, perfect. Parents like her so much more than they like me. What? <laughs> 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 Alright guys, it's 4.59 p.m. We're about to start the showing of I'm Just a YouTuber, the very first one ever. Uh, and I am, I'm kind of nervous. I'm really, really like excited to see what people think. And I'm excited, I'm, I'm honestly excited to watch it back myself because I've only seen it like once. And a lot of times it takes like the second and third watching to kind of like really settle in. Especially like when you live the life in that you're filming right so um very excited for this moment justin is where i uh, let me see if i can get justin justin the man of the hour the man of the year the here man right here wouldn't be anything without him. we pulled together the 10-year video um back in february for my birthday and that was like a big big take like that was a big project that was a huge project that was at that time, the biggest project I've ever done. And we, like for me too, that was like the biggest riding on that video. And like we executed. And then like right immediately went into the second biggest project 
of both of our lives, yeah. which is a soccer movie. Huge, yeah. I never thought that I would do a feature film this soon in my career, but leave it to Christian to like push people to be better. So it's been, man, it's been it, an for, insane ride. For those of you that don't know, Justin started with Alphalete back in, he, he essentially he won the competition that I made public. So back in 2017, mm -hmm. I believe. Yeah. I, and when I was in Alaska, I, I did a whole videographer challenge. You have to make a video, submit um, to be out with the videographer. Mm -hmm. And Justin won that competition, came on board, and we've been working together ever since on Alphalete, on personal projects like this, and um, just kind of taking it year by year. Yeah. And constantly like being a, a constant denominator in each other's lives. Yeah. And this is Kirby's husband. Yeah. Kirby! Wow! Hi. Whoa! <laughs> Look at Thanks you! For being here. Oh my gosh! <laughs> so it was kind of like a package deal, which was just a, a blessing in my life. And this is uh, it's yeah. crazy. It's all come come down to this, but it's Are not you nervous. Stop. No, I feel good now. Feel good. I feel good now that it all came together. Everyone's here. There's people that actually showed up. <laughs> so, yeah, no, I feel good. I'm, I'm glad. Just thank you, man. I'm super thankful. Let's go watch it. Let's do Can it. we grab a picture really quick yeah. before, we, yeah. before we go yeah. in there? Perfect. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Get yourself. It is time for the first showing of I'm Just a YouTuber, the unseen chapter of public life. There we go. Super excited. We're going to get everyone together and get going to the theater. So let's go. What's up, Mom? How are you? I love that one. Good. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. How are you? Yes, you did. <laughs> Ready? Like Kevin and them picked out his idea. All right, where's y'all in there? Hi. What's up, Chels? Hello. Beautiful. I know. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for coming. That meant so much to me, to Christian, to Kirby, to everyone. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for sticking to it. Thank you to Nabil and Oz. Um, you guys, there's no way we could have done this project without y'all. Y'all are incredible. And thank you to Christian for trusting us to be able to tell this story. Our goal for the film was to, obviously all of us live in a culture where we're used to hearing like push yourself to your limits, but the goal was to be able to recognize that it's okay to admit to um, when you need help and it's okay to rely on your friends and family and that we're all stronger together than we are individually so hopefully that message was received um, if you're competing this weekend good luck for summer shredding and um, y'all are more than welcome to hang out in the lobby to eat more food and take more pictures but thank y'all for coming Good job, the man. Hey guys. Kevin, good, good job. job. You killed it. Yeah, bro. What, wow. What, what'd you think? I like it, I, I liked it up, so man? much more like yeah. the second time. Like really that was that was so good. It's just weird seeing myself on there. Like I don't like seeing myself talk. <laughs> no, you did so good. <laughs> good job, Kirby. So good. You killed it. Kirby. 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 That, was like, yeah. that was like, that was like so, much better, so right, much better than at my house. Yeah. It was so like, good at the house, but like, yeah, but no, that was a whole experience. Totally different experience. Yeah. You guys wow. did so good. Kirby. Thank you. Thanks wow. for being a part of it and helping wow. tell the story. Wow. So that, that was like so yeah. good. Yeah. I didn't think it was possible to like keep your heart rate this high for so long. <laughs> like, the whole movie, I was like, we're in here. Nothing can, like, why are you still? Yeah. yeah. Everything yeah, you said made a lot of, you just did it perffect. You yeah. directed it so perfect. Thank you. Thank you all so much. Wow, so Kurt, that was serious. You thought the same thing, right? Like, uh, I thought it was so much better. Oh yeah, like, like I, I've, I've seen it a million times throughout all the editing process and seeing it, I guess it's been because we took like a little break. But seeing it here is like watching it for the first time. Yeah. yeah. Like it was cool to be able to see it kind of from like fresh yeah. eyes. Like I didn't even eat, like, I didn't, you know, that one like drone thing I noticed the first sight? I didn't even see didn't that either. this time. I was looking for it. I was, I was looking like, for was it. Was that even there? Like I didn't notice any of the little mistakes we were being nitpicked. I didn't either, like at all. Yeah. 
please tell Justin that. I think we're going to ch chill here for a yeah, bit. But yeah, like, yeah. That was wow. incredible. Are y'all going to sit through the, all, the next one too? Are you? Yeah. Not? Yeah. Well, we're going to be here. I just didn't know if y'all were going to like hang out in the lobby or if I you think want to like, sit keep watching. Here I, I want to watch yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah, I want to watch it again. Yeah. It was the ending for me, Kirby. It was like the end. It was like, Kirby, 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 oh. Kirby. Oh, yeah. I know. There were so many things that they were like, we need to put these credits in. And I was like, we have a very small crew. They were like, yes. So we're just going to. Wait, what was that all about? That makes it cooler. What was that? You, <laughs> said, you said, um, I have a lot of stories I could tell about Christian. And then oh, that made a funny And then Nabil was like, intro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to go take some pictures. Okay, bye, right, Kobe. Job, congratulations. Congratulations. Nice to be so proud of you. Thank you all so much for being a part of this and right, for trusting right. us, seriously. So good. A thousand out of wow. ten. They yeah. can see Aww, thank you. Hollywood. Yeah, can't wait for the next one, Kirby. I know everyone keeps saying that. I'm like, no, next one, no, next one. Maybe six months from now. <laughs> Hell yeah. Or three. <laughs>
transformation females. I'm late. Media. Okay, I need to go over championship. I got you. <laughs> no, I need my phone. I think it's only a new phone. No, no, no. You want me to do it for you? No, you didn't. Do it. Do it. Do it. I know you. Long way. You're a minimalist. You said. <laughs> he said he's a minimalist. Hey, LOL. Yeah. yeah, you lose everything. <laughs> I left it. Whoops. Yeah, on accident apparently. What did he leave? Left his little minimalist phone. A little iPhone 13 and mini. LOL. I had to get a brand new one. Oh my gosh. Like right at my door, What's ready for me. On Monday, right? Mm, I should know. Oh my god, you want to hype everybody up, please? No, no. What's up, guys? Wow, this is so crazy. This is, we, I, I have never, ever, ever witnessed anything like this in my life. Thank you all so much for being here. Um, we have. Apparently, 600 plus total competitors here. Wow, this is so crazy. This is so crazy. Wow. You guys are going to be a part of history. This is the very first summer training championship you will ever have. By the end of the weekend, two of you will be crowned the champions of the year. So, wow, this is, uh, this is the first for all of us. So, we are very just decided to you know, do it with you guys and you know build something that will last a lifetime. So with no further ado, we have Ashley here with all of the information for the weekend. And if you have any questions, get them like start thinking about them. So we can, you know, there's this is our first time ever doing it. There's no shame in having questions. Let's just like confirm we're all on the same page and we're ready for the weekend. Alright, so here she is. Welcome to Summer Training and Cheer. Ready? Oh, here we go, it's going. Okay, good. It's the wrong turn. He's vlogging for you, too. Ready? One, two, three. Welcome to Summer Training! Woo! <laughs> yeah, that was great. That was great, good job. Thank you, guys. Yeah, how, how come no one's here for photos? <laughs> here. Here. Where? Here. Oh, shit. No, we're leaving. Oh, That's what she brought up. Okay. Did right. you smell normal or like your... It is my cheesy one. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Yeah, that's Wait, dope. That that's that dope. Too. We're gonna kill it. Are we? Yeah, we, we are. are. No, final some works. Okay. I'm ready. I'll turn it off. Right turn now? It off. Yeah. Alright. We're gonna kill it. I got all of it. That was I got nuts. So many angles from everyone. Ooh. Look at this shirt. I, them all. I love that shirt. Can you see right? You see the back? Your airdrop. Your airdrop? I'm sending your airdrop right now. So dope. And on the side you got the Houston, Texas. Oh, oh yeah. Chelsea's got on one of our new ones. The Heat Wave. Uh, heat Wave. Heat Wave. Super dope. It's like, but neutrals. There's Becca's got on the same wave. one. Heat Becca, wave. say hi to the vlog. Okay. Becca's looking great. Hey, yeah. Long time. Okay, Moys. I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. Your hair looks so good, bro. Thank you. Yeah, man. Huh? You recently get a haircut? I'm glad you stopped trying to grow up. Yeah, it's good. Love the shade, love the shade. We got Harry over here. What's up, Harry? Let me see your shirt, bro. That one's dope. That's sick. It's like predator shit. No back, no back, no back, no back. How are the photos? Uh, uh, dope. Nine point nine out of ten. Nine point nine? Yeah. Ooh, I'm at. Well, I'm gonna have to insert them here, bro. Okay. Can you get them done in time? Yeah. For sure. Alrighty. Well, How many do you want? It? What? Three, five? Let's just go three. Heat map. map. Let's just go three. Heat map. <laughs> oh, heat map. I was like, that's wrong, but I was 
Yeah. I go, so what is the predator type of shit? <laughs> Heat map. Heat map. You want three photos? Yeah, we can do three. The three. What do we do? Your summer striding photos, yeah? Wait, for the whole weekend? How about you post like nine? Because you're going to do a lot, right? Okay, yeah. Nine. Nine. All right, ready? And boom, 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 ba, uh, uh, eight, nine, done. Damn, bro. That was nuts. You like him? That, you like him? Woo, comment down below. I like him. Fuck yeah, good shit, man. So, guys, that is a wrap. It's right at 7 o'clock. We anticipated being done right at 7. So, that was perfect. All right. I'm so, like, oily. Look at the fit, though. Really like this fit. Um, this is our new press T coming out really happy with the, this logo because we haven't had like a night we haven't had a shape other than like this wolf head for a long time we had the badge long ago and had to get rid of that and now we have this it's not a full like logo but like a graphic and a logo are different because the graphic is like more one-time use the logo is more permanent so i wouldn't call this a logo but it's a variation that maybe we can kind of stick around with more often if it gets good feedback but it's super cool. I like the back a lot. Shit. Use on the back. Oh my God, I'm not flexible. Man, bro, that was bad flexibility. You see that? I'm like, oh. Low key, kind of like my favorite equipped gym. Yeah, it's like 60 40. Gym two, 60%. Gym one. Oh, no, I can't even give a percent. Never mind. Then gym three is like, oh, I love that place. <laughs> so I can't do that. But yeah, this is an upstairs area where people do cardio. Um, we've got this line of turf that goes this way. We've got the rower, the bike, the little uh, ham raises. Oh, well, the new one came in. Yeah, uh, those bikes, this sprinter, all this line of uh, cardio here. But this is new. I just ordered this like four weeks ago. Got two of them. One here for one for gym one. Yeah, one. What the fuck? One for gym one and one for gym two. But there's the brand. And yeah. So that's a wrap. Go buy the Ghost Free Workout. Someone go buy the Ghost Free Workout. Go buy the Ghost Free Workout. Woo! You want a foot? I would love a foot. Can you give me two of those? I always finish them like so easy. I knew like extra noodle chicken, but like do two of them. Okay. Okay. No, sorry, <laughs> I fucked up the couch. Oh my god, I'm gonna show them the couch. Oh man, so I okay, we, we were kind of in a rush, but I was like, I'm tired of not I was in a rush and I'm tired of not having a freaking rug. So we've just had like this coffee table and then we've had the couch, but Heidi's like because Nala keeps peeing on the rugs. And it's only, it, no, she, it's because when she's, when it rains or storms, she just can't, she's like, you can't, that doesn't count. That's not, no. She pees on there when she just sees a new rug. She's like, man, I've seen her do it. It's no. Man, I've seen her. I, like, be I believe uh, her. Peeing on it. I think I believe her. She didn't tell you shit. I, she's looking at me right. like, <laughs> she's looking at me like, you're, oh my God. She's looking at you like, this is so funny. She Look at literally sees me rocks and she pees on them because of you. No. <laughs> I know. Yeah, I've seen you do it. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. That's so good. I'm so happy I got that on footage. Oh man. Uh, but. <laughs> will you film me, babe? I mean. Oh, you're ordering food. What are you getting? Do you guys like. When, you, when I'm vlogging, do you care if like, you can see me? Or can I just like hold the camera like this? Or do I do I have to do like, or like do I have I have to do some of this? Right, this is way better. Yeah, this is better. Right? Or can I just like can I narrate? I can hold it even more steady if I'm just like narrating. You know, I could be like, Yo, Heidi. French bread. You want French bread? <laughs> I would love to have some French bread. Can we get like pho and something else though? Let me see uh, the back of your shirt. 
<laughs> so sick. You can't buy those. Look at my cute pants. I got so many compliments. Look at the flares. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, they're the perfect length. Really let me are. see, let me see the look. Wow. The, what length are these? Are these short? Right? Those are literally made for you. Short. I love it. Well, I, I kind of made them on your body, so. Let me see the logo. Come here. <laughs> Bend over the couch. Come here, come here, come here. Okay, amazing seam work here on the Aura Collection. Tonal logo. Uh, turn to the side. And now you can see this beautiful, con this like seam line. Uh, let me see the waistband because it connects. I fucking nailed this one. I'm not gonna like. Let me see the side waistband. Look at the beautiful line. This was so hard to connect from like that part to connect to that uh, horizontal seam, and then to connect smoothly to go down. Oh, like oh. butter. No front they seam, of like course. Butter. They feel amazing. How'd you describe this fabric? like the best literally the best cut and sew fabric we've ever done if you like surface if you yeah. like alphalux you we're not making either of those anymore because this one was this too damn good whoa this one was yeah. too damn good that i i, I like I, I felt like i couldn't have both surface alphalux and no, this, new this fabric. is like those other fabrics are great but this one i was like this is just better stretch soft you know what it reminds me of and i, and I never say this uh, the aligned fabric Mm. Mm -hmm. It does. Can, right? can you feel me good? Yeah. So, if I had to say, if I had to tell you the amount of samples that I've gone through to launch, because the Aura Collection, because that fabric is so good, so well, here's a little business talk. Okay. So, because that fabric is so good, and like I knew it was, I knew it was money. It was like, okay, the cost is like not like astro it's not terrible, terrible. So. I can get a like, decent price if I buy in bulk. So I bought a lot of fabric up front because I knew like once I saw the samples and how they fit on and how the fabric just like was consistent and that it wasn't just like a test fabric that some of the, the mill was using. It was actually like the bulk of the fabric, you know, the same, it was matching that what I would be getting, right? So I bought in bulk yeah. to eventually split into like three different drops. But what I'm getting at is there was like 25 fucking styles to design. And I wanted to do it all at the same time and just kind of get them all done at once instead of draw, like putting in group one. Let me like only do those styles in group two. I wanted to knock it all out because I had plans of like shifting my focus from Al Fleet like manufacturing, you know, to coming to do what? What? Dollar. To do this. Keep going. Um, so yeah, it was a lot. It was like probably like, man, those flares are probably like 11 rounds of samples maybe. Yeah, it's a lot. A lot. Like a You've been working on for like, what, two years? Yeah, like close to two years of my life. Mine too. I helped you try them on. You, yeah, you have a lot. <laughs> the bandeau. Yeah. Oh my gosh, all the fucking, varia all the variations we had to yeah. fucking do. But the collection is literally flawless. Like, I, I love, the Aura collection is like, has so much of like, my fucking work in it. I, like, so much of my work in it, my, my, my late nights, my, all of that was to make this collection be one that can stay on Alfleet for uh, forever, really. Like, I think that this this Aura collection will remain a, a fabric that you will love to keep something forever. Like, you'll just love it. Okay, so go and get it on October 28th. Use code Guzman. Um, yeah, you women will love it. It all matches the Amplify V2, the Amplify Contour, like the shorts, the leggings that just came out. So go like get it with that. The Republic tees for you guys are fucking dope. And women have a crop, but the guys tees, we have so many good variations with the foam print, with the embroidery, proud but never satisfied. Uh, they're oversized or higher neck with the fabric versus like the like these pump tees. This is more like rough and kind of just like scratchy. The other ones are just like plush, soft, uh, almost like foamy, like thick kind of plushy texture. So good. Um, and there's like leveled up to me, way leveled up to me for not much more price, if any. Um, and yeah, the joggers are great. Just the weightlifting belts are fucking genuine, smooth ass, like almost like suede feeling leather that are just like extra, extra foamy on the waist, but not bulky. Cause you like, I like when you can kind of keep them on for the whole workout if you want, mm -hmm. but it's enough support 
And it's just like we put a lot of cushion in that little support. And we had the indented logo on the, on the back and on the front little thing. And the matching um, tonal matching metal was really hard to color match too, but we did it. So the hoodie, everything. So go get the launch October 28th. Uh, and yeah. What's the pink color called? Porcelain. Oh, porcelain's my favorite. Mm -hmm. These ones kind of porcelain, right? That's pewter. And then no, there's- No, but the pink one. Yeah, I think so, yeah. Yeah, for sure. And if you guys don't want to use code Guzman, you can use code NYLA. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow. Just go Guzman. No, code NYLA. I don't want to get beat by a dog. <laughs> <laughs> okay, definitely use code NYLA. <laughs> um, I think we're going to go work out. I'm down. No, I'm down. It's early. How's it? I. Cool. Uh, I just ordered food, so. Oh, let's eat that then. And then. It's gonna come in like 45 minutes. Yeah, we good. We'll have a late workout. Okay. <laughs> Why don't we go work out in the garage? I have. No, that won't work for me. What do you have? Push. Can you switch it up? Like, can you no. just do arms real quick? No. Wanna do legs with me? No, I don't know. I can do back. Kind of late. Fuck, we should have worked out earlier. Somebody didn't have a fucking meeting. Oh my gosh. Okay, little update for you guys. We are currently waiting for dinner because we had already ordered it. Play Mortal Kombat. We're both being the same player to really tell who's the best player. So you better. Oh! What's that? That's three for three. I literally have a scar. You do. I'm actually dressed for the gym now, so I'm ready to go after we eat. Hey, we're going. Yeah. No, I'm, we are. I'm, I'm going. I am inclined barbell bench pressing two nights. I don't know why I thought you were going to throw a controller in my face. There's Nala. Chilling out. Okay, go ahead. Four for four. Let's go. Let's go. Wow, look how good. Guys, I'm using the iPhone 15 Pro. Uh, not the big one, but the new, the Pro, right? Uh, with the new filming capability to do it in like whatever log. So we're color grading the footage with just like a natural colored thing. So it's still natural, but it's like with the, we're filming it with the log. It takes some more space on the phone, but it looks incredible. Like, look at the screen. Let me like darken it a bit. Look, like. Look at that. Crazy. These lights have changed my freaking life. I wish I would have bought them sooner. Uh, they just like point in both directions like this. You got them on Amazon. I'm turn the light on. Here. These are them. Amazing. Like, I just love them so much. I put them all over the house. They're just awesome. I always see them. Um, but I'm on my way to get Heidi Band-Aids. And, oh, shoo -hoo -hoo. I just wanna say that, guys, I, I've never been this happy in my relationship, like, ever in my entire life, like, for real. Um, and it feels like really, I don't know, just, I didn't think that, um, like proposing to her would make us feel that different. And maybe, I, I don't know why I just didn't, I don't know, I just, to me it's like, we've been so stable and so, you know, like we've known each other, are gonna be each other's people for so long. Uh, and it feels like we just kinda, we got like really, really busy, uh, you know, and just kinda like lost sight of, you know, taking time for ourselves like that was kind of like my perspective you know naively you know because you know though she doesn't or she never talked about it often or anything and brought it up you know every i don't know why i keep saying you know i'm sorry <laughs> like I consciously just saying you know i never do that very weird but um yeah i just i'm so happy right now that's what i'm getting at and life is just so good it's like i just 2023 has been the best year of my entire life and like i feel like i'm finally getting to after 
years of like 2020, February 2020 is when I got the key to Alphaland. 2019 Black Friday, <laughs> Alphaland almost destroyed me all the way up until getting that key at Alphaland, right? And it's just like since then, I just went on like a never, what seemed like a just never ending like grind, which I don't regret for one fucking second. I don't regret for one second because it's put me here where I am now. And I feel like from 20, February 2020, or if you want to say through Black Friday 2019, up until really like my, my prep this year, my prep this year, but specifically like going to Florida, seeing Chris Bum said, hanging out with him, Calvin, Courtney for like a week and just like slowing down, being by myself and um, just like getting kind of opened up to, you know, therapy and, and just like, and talking to people and talking about your emotions and stuff like that. That's something that growing up, I was never, you know, encouraged to do that or like, I don't know, maybe it's growing up in a Mexican family or whatever. I don't know, but just like... You know, shut the fuck up. What, what, what do you mean? <laughs> like, you have food today? Good. Don't complain. You know, it's kind of like your men are we're, we're just brought to, I don't know. Anyway, I worked really damn hard, is what I'm trying to say, for like three years straight. Um, and I feel like with prep, seeing Chris and sort of opening up to just like thinking deeper into my thoughts and like why, you know, finding for the reasons, why am I doing things? Why am I responding this way? Why is this person possibly like, what does that viewpoint look like? Or like asking like, I don't know, we, it changed my life, honestly. And I feel like a new person, right? I feel I'm, I'm just recharging still from not my show. It's not my show that I'm recharging from. I'm recharging from the three years of really, really intensive, like, strain on my body and on myself my mental health my yeah everything and would i take it would i do it again or, like, or take it would i take anything back hell no like i wouldn't take anything back but i wouldn't wish that upon anybody ever because i really really push my body on healthy limits and like and would just push to stay up and stay up and stay up even when it wasn't when it wasn't at all beneficial at all like and i there was some, I don't know, I don't take anything back, but it could have been, I could have done it better. I could have done it smoother. I could have done it healthier. And hopefully like, I don't know, I just, I feel like I'm realizing so much the support I've got now by just investing my time into the, the people that I want to, like the grass isn't evergreen. It's, it's green where you fucking water the grass. Right. And I think for me, like, I don't know. We we just growing some distance. It felt like it, it just we find like open to start talking things out and just like coming back together and just like you know once that kind of click happened, it's just like fuck. Like things are things are. It's just like we're year one again. It's wild, but we're having so much fun. I think ice cream's here. I'm gonna get our sandwiches, but I'm gonna stop filming and go eat. And we're gonna go to the gym. So love you, Heidi, so much. You've changed my life and it's a good fucking year.